One major problem that we face as a society is the age-associated neurodegenerative diseases, including Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's disease, and frontotemporal dementia that currently have no cure. My lab is very interested in understanding the root cause at the very molecular level and treat these kind of diseases. My name is Munder Aburimele. I'm assistant professor of chemical engineering and genetics at Stanford University. This is why my research matters. You can think of ourselves as a city. In a city, you always produce waste. Waste should be recycled. And if the recycling center doesn't function properly, this will impact the city. And over time, the city would become dysfunctional. Lysosomes in the cell are the recycled bin. If the lysosome is not functional, the toxin will start to accumulate. And this accumulation of toxin will end up killing these cells Neurons in particular are cells that are very vulnerable. For lysosomes to perform their degradative function, they require a lipid called BMP. We recently discovered the enzyme that degrades this lipid. By boosting BMP levels, we were able to enhance lysosomal function in neurodegenerative diseases. So we think the potential is really big. For example, we know that in frontotemporal dementia, there are lower levels of BMP. So we believe that by enhancing these levels, we'll be able to treat this disease. The same is true when you think about Alzheimer's disease where cholesterol is accumulating. This is very similar to Neiman Big Type C, which we were able to treat in our most recent publication. I think the value in funding fundamental science is very important especially when we are facing all these kind of diseases that have literally no cure. And without having the opportunity to take risks, it's almost impossible to train people to be the next generation of scientists.